Complete Clapton is a greatest hits collection by British rock musician Eric Clapton, released on October 9, 2007 to accompany Clapton's official autobiography. Release The two-disc collection was released on October 9, 2007 to accompany Eric Clapton's official autobiography, Clapton, The Autobiography, released that same year. An exclusive edition sold through Barnes & Noble bookstores in the United States included a bonus compact disc with four additional tracks. As with the Rolling Stones' 40 licks, each disc has been compiled by different record companies, Disc 1, virtually identical to The Cream of Clapton by Polydor, and Disc 2 by Warner Brothers. Records Clapton helped to promote the album by being interviewed by Matt Lauer on The Today Show in 2007. Commercial success, the compilation debuted at number 14 on the U.S. Billboard 200, selling about 45,000 copies in its first week. It also peaked at number 2 on the British Albums Chart, compiled by the official charts company and topped both the Korean Albums and International Albums Chart, selling more than 2 million copies in 2007 and 2015. On the Korean year-end chart for International Albums, the album stayed at number 2 in 2007, the highest Korean year-end position ever to be achieved by a British artist and by a foreign compilation album. Track listing, all songs are by Eric Clapton, except where noted. Critical reception, all music critic Stephen Thomas Aleween quickly notes that this compilation doesn't even attempt to cover as much ground as his landmark four-disc 1988 box set Crossroads but also recalls complete Clapton over the nearly 20 years that have elapsed since the release of Crossroads, a time frame which includes the blockbuster success of his 1992 Unplugged, It's All Blues 1994 follow-up from The Cradle, and many soft adult contemporary hits from the late 90s. Eliwin rounds his review up by saying, Complete Clapton into a portrait of Clapton the classic rocker, and Pac, S, many surprises, but it does hit the obvious highlights well and serves as a good hits package for the casual and curious fan, and in that sense, it works as a good companion piece to Clapton's autobiography. Chart Positions Certifications References <laughs>